I get it, but also leave me. Oh! Oh my! Oh my! What the heck? Oh my gosh! What? I gotta be honest, wasn't expecting that. guys and welcome to GT Not Live. Welcome back to London and welcome back to Ruin. Uh, yeah, for those of you who don't know, uh, Ruin, we are in the middle of our playthrough. We just hop through a virtual screen and there are questions. And there are questions. A lot. Of, I mean, even it, here, cut to the cut to the game real yep. quick. Even the game has questions. It says reboot the daycare attendant and access the theater. Everything is not as it seems. So even the mission descriptions agree with us. Yeah, it is confusing. And it's like, I don't even feel like they mentioned the daycare attendant in the last one. Right! <laughs> that, that, that's a spoiler right there. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking the exact same thing. I'm like, at no point has that been a, brought up as a mission to no, us. No, it, so. it said, go to the daycare. Yeah. Cool, I understand that. Why is it not just, go to daycare? No, it's go to daycare. <laughs> you know, it's tough to write in a lot of text assets in there. You gotta streamline it. Just get to the point. You know, we'll figure it out. <laughs> too, then too much pussyfooting around. Just get straight to the point. Yeah, that's true. Speaking of too much pussyfooting around and getting straight to the point, we should wrap up the witty banter and just yeah, hop into it. We this. should go straight to you, this. You don't need an intro. <laughs> We're in a digital world. It seems like the AI is taking over our mind slowly. We can't trust anything. It's all it's all related to the books. If all of this is confusing to you, which it probably should be, go read the last. Seven, 18 books. Okay, that's your that's your that's summer your, reading assignment. That's your assignment. Eighteen you books. Go. All you English teachers out there, eighteen. Oh, you could you could design an entire course around Freddie Fazbear's like literature. I feel like there's probably some censorship that might have to happen. There are there's quite they get quite graphic at points. They, they do. They are brutal. The games are or sorry the, the books are brutal. Yeah, like, Tiger Rock. At the very end, he just like rips the kids up, and it's like, and it's describing like the buckets of blood it's beneath him. You're like the the, huh? e the epilogues that talk about the mimic, like oh, which again, this rough. is they're they're brutal. Like like because unlike a lot of the other short stories where you don't have a whole lot of time to bond with the characters, in that one you bond with you spend a lot of time bonding with the characters, and then slowly watching as bit by bit people get picked off. It's like, oh, that is so sad. And it's I just, feel really awful reading them. And it is just savage. It it's is br it's yeah. brutal. It's, it's not just like, some of them, they kind of leave a mystery where like she's like clamped yeah. by a stomach hatch and you right. just, but you don't really hear or see anything. It's just like, and the stomach hatch closes, bam. And you could presume yeah. what happens. This is like, oh no, let me describe yeah, to they you describe the sounds you, like, I hear. In, in like brutal detail, like, oh, oh, and the crunching of the bones and the pooling of the blood. And you're like, oh my gosh, this was a, fun, happy game series. About <laughs> Actually, it never was. It was never a fun, happy game series. It was always like dead bodies got shoved into animatronics. But we didn't think about it that deeply. We didn't have to think about no, it. No, we didn't have to actually think about it. <laughs> but when you're presented with like the reality of the situation, it gets rough. Uh, yeah, just as a reminder, we're in London because FNAF games in my life drop at like the worst possible situations. And so I was uh, hanging out with Steph and doing some work in London. So we got to pop down to Tom's house. So welcome to Tom's house. Uh, Hi. This is, this is my house. <laughs> It doesn't feel like my own anymore. There's so much stuff. <laughs> welcome. Welcome to a life on YouTube. There you go. I'm like Steph, Steffi has been saying, we are, we are now, are we now properly YouTubers? This like, is it. This is it. Your when, house when, is your set. When your personal space has become a set for content, that's it. So you've crossed the threshold. All right. So hey, Man. let's do that mission that we absolutely knew that we were doing from the get-go. Reboot the daycare attendant and then access the theater, shall we? Let's do it. Let's go. Okay, so... Darkness. Yeah. Right. Welcome to the dark lands. Uh, so these were the um, the clouds were like the things we were seeing in the trailer that felt like almost organic. Oh yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the the blobby things that were yeah, hanging out. Blobs or whatever. And again, I just want to call this out. I, I mentioned this towards the end of the last mm. episode, but the fact that Purple Land. It's Gregory again, but yep. it's all like reversed right. and whispered and stuff. Yeah, like the that. fact that Purple Land is so much brighter. I want to be in Purple Land all the time because. It's just easier to see things. Yeah. It is just much more pleasant to exist in it's that It's easier world. to find the lore. <laughs> <laughs> the lore just jumps out to you. It's so highlighted. <laughs> As opposed to not. Okay, so last time we saw that some of the arcade cabinets here do function. but they just activate. Yeah, yeah, but just in VR land. So that's good to know. 
we have still to find any sort of real life collectible. All our yeah. collectibles so far have been the AR collectibles, which it, I think is also important to call it, out. It's just a red herring. It's there to make you think there's collectibles and send people trailing through the game over and over again. Right. <laughs> and there's actually nothing there. Nothing there the entire time. <laughs> also interesting, there's another animatronic endoskeleton that has there's it's a, covered in and I think that's another one. Yeah, there's another one. So again, this goes to one of the theories that we had in our uh, kind of most recent game theory on this game prior to it releasing is the idea that, hey, all of these endoskeletons were being trained up, basically, or being infused with a lot of AI and data to become the next Afton, to mm. evolve into a, a creature that behaves like Afton does, um, which is why you're seeing them so... Ooh, a glitchy item. I love that's only half of them are security nodes and just everything else is like, oh, okay. Huh. That's weird. Mmm, so that's like a new entrance. That's where we're going, but well, that's weird. Right? Well, no, that's not where we're going. That's... Oh, is that where Oh, we're... yeah, so... No, oh, it is where we're going. I thought I was looking at this thing. I thought you were as well. Oh, I'll weird. be honest, but it turns you round. Oh, it does turn me around. It turns you to show you where you're supposed to be looking. <laughs> We don't trust you to find this. <laughs> That's weird. Why does it force me to turn around? That's really bizarre. But we, yeah. Yeah, because I look at this, right? I'm looking at this and I was like, oh, here but, I go. But now. But now if I just take off my mask. Oh, well, no. Well, that then. time it did it. That time you were close enough because like, you're not yeah, in apparently this spot. I, I crossed over. Okay. But it, yeah, but it's interesting. When you cross thresholds like that, I've uh -huh. noticed it stops you being able to activate your mask. Yeah, my, uh, my mask is gone. Which is, here we are, our favorite... Oh, I hate moon. Honestly, scariest part of Security Breach. Oh, easily. He just has that, it's that raspy voice, mm -hmm. the shadows, the kind of creepy, and the fact that he like just tiptoes towards you is almost like mm -hmm. you can see him coming. Whoa. Oh, there. there he is! Oh. Well, that was nice. Hi, friends. Great. I'm, I'm, gl I'm, I'm glad that me shining a flashlight in your general direction was enough to stop you, so that's good. Well, yeah, and again, like, because I know that he stopped or slowed down yeah. when you flat, like, put the light on him in the last one. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, no, that's... Sorry, yeah. yeah, funny that it's like, oh, yeah, but now it's, like, enough to, like, totally right, send like, him off. Hey, you know, he went through some stuff at the end of the last game. He did. You know, his eye sockets are, like, more sensitive than they were before. We've all been there. He's gotten yeah. a little bit older. Like, I mean, sensitivity this is, the is a thing that he's got to be concerned about. He was just, like, a bystander, really. Like, we were burning down the pizza plex, and he was just kind of there. <laughs> yeah, he was observing. He was observing. I love that FNAF has, has now leaned into, Oh, blacked out eyes with bleeding black mm. tears. It's awesome. Yeah. Giving that's... us all permission to use that imagery from now until the end of time. Yeah, that is, that's proper a analog horror YouTube ARG. That's interesting. So um, I'm... But you can't, so you can't currently, oh, you can in that room, but not. So I can for this moment here. Interesting. But not for anything else. Weird. But maybe for here too. Yeah. Wild. Oh, if you just. No! Wait. Seriously? No! Oh no, there no! was there was probably there a was collectible! Lore! There was lore to be had! Oh, that's so annoying. Yeah, wait, can I can I Oh Can I do this? Can you? I might be able to. We don't know wait. where saved progress is, so this is risky. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out, Tom. Run. Continue. Oh yep, so it's chapter an auto two. Oh, we're so in chapter it's, two. So it's an auto save function. Great. Back to the very beginning of the game. Yeah, yeah. Chapter two is actually like your second step. <laughs> Please let the beginning of chapter two be this. When if, we got into the daycare, it feels or... like it must have been. Yes. Yes. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. We have a, We got our, our second chance. Excellent. Okay. So where do I not want to fall? I don't want to fall through that one area. So. So yeah, because there were the two options, weren't there? Yeah. So. Okay, so generator. I do love that one of the books, I forget which one it is, yeah, one of the talks, books talks about, about the, generators. the generators being in the daycare and they're like, why is this here? It's like, eh, it's like a cost-cutting measure. Yeah. And uh -huh. you're just like, what? Why? How? And it's just, but they don't, they don't explain, really explain it. It's just like, uh, there's a, there's a reason for you. Yep. Okay, sun mask. 
AR sun mask. Okay. Uh, can I see it? No. Uh, maybe try now. That yeah, I was like going to say, maybe it's... I was too fast yeah. on the trigger. Fun, fun, fun. So we got cry and cry fun, fun, fun. Cry and fun, fun, fun. That, that summarizes my feelings when playing these games. <laughs> <laughs> really? You have fun, fun, fun? <laughs> I mean, depends on what you define as fun. Right. Like, breaking the game beyond all recognition. Like, gi like Gigamonty. Oh, that was quite fun. Did you play through the... I, I watched a lot of the Gigamonty stuff for Security it, Breach. It was a blast. It was hilariously fun. I also really enjoyed learning how to speed run the, the moon segment. Mm. So literally didn't have for me to know. Yeah. It was it's rough. Yeah. But it's literally just once you know where everything is. Oh, and hello. You... So yeah, other eye is there. We need to be home. You want me to reboot you? With this? I love his animations, like oh. his teeth. His animation, his voice. Oh, and he's just flying around. It appears that daycare attendant is malfunctioning. The bright light seems to disorient it. Okay. Turn on the generators as you have a reboot the system. Once all the generators are active, use the faz wrench port on the back of its faceplate. Like AR moon pinata filled with moon drop candies. Excellent. He is what candy that helps you go to sleep. Great, right? So it's interesting that he calls out, I'm caught in a dream, or I'm caught in a nap, he said. I'm, hello, hello, hi, hello, hello, hi. He says, I am caught in a nap, right? So in the, okay, yeah. again, the books, I'm so sorry that we have to constantly talk about the books at this point. They're mad true reading guys, well, sorry, we don't make the rules. Yeah. <laughs> but in the books, that's a big part of it is, mm. oh, hey. You a node? Yeah, you are definitely, ooh. Okay. Okay. Yes, this is a thing. What do I gotta do with this though? Like, what do you want me to do? Thanks, Greg. No, we detected. Oh wait. Oh, did you? Oh, okay. I, I gotta find both anomalies. But oh, also there's the D mask. Okay. D mask. Oh, here it comes. Okay. Here he comes. So he's coming at me. Here comes Speed Racer. <laughs> so in the in the books, here I'm just gonna give it a second to reset, yep. so that way I can do this again. But in the in the books, there's uh, uh, the first time that Moondrop appears. Mm. It, he's in this like little like snow globe thing that you yeah. you look at it and he like puts you to sleep, and then you're in this like hyperactive dream state. Yeah. Where you're able to learn things really quickly and it refreshes you and it's like super sleep. It's awesome. Mm. But they say only do it for ten minutes. Only do it for ten minutes. Otherwise, you know, bad things are going to happen, and lo and behold, bad things happen. Um, you know, some kid like <laughs> right goes goes overboard, and now all of a sudden he's like put into a permanent coma. But like the idea of him being put into some sort of like deep sleep or deep nap or whatever, that I think that's really interesting. Yeah, I also find it just interesting. He's like, we need to we need to be whole, right? Because the first time we saw him, it was the red eye on the moon side. That yep. time we saw him, it was the white eye on the sun side. Great, so we found the moon. Oh. Let's get out. Okay, there he comes. So we found one of them. Okay. So this is, yeah, so this is the thing we are kind of looking at. Right. On the camera, and that's telling us which one we're looking for, which anomaly we're looking for. Yeah. I guess. Well, I think we have to find both in order to We, we do, thing, but, right? but it was like, because it was si sim... It was... Oh, oh hey. Oh no, is he gonna actually be trying to jump scare us right now? What, what are you doing, buddy? Hey, hey, where you at? Where you at, Home Slice? Where you at, Moon Slice? <laughs> but that's what I think is gonna be interesting is go, oh, there's an another camp. Or is that the same one? What am I supposed to do with this guy now? Oh, it's a different. Do I lure him away? Oh, uh, there he is, yeah. So oh, this there is to he help is. lure him. You would think that. So he's directly above us right now. But I can't actually lure him. Oh, you can't do that. Like, I can't use the sound to lure him away. Here, let's, let's finish off this anomaly thing right here. Let's, let's finish off this little guy. Do I have to find both of them? Both in the before span? the... So there's one. So, oh, that's, so that's the sun. 
And then we know the moon one. Oh, so we're looking specifically for the moon one. So you have to do the moon one first. So that's on camera five. Yeah, that's five first. Okay. And you go back to yeah. one, and then you go and to the And then you sun. gotta go, to, yeah. And that's on camera three. Okay, there we go. Now we jump scare. Now get out. Now now we get here. Mask. Mask. mask And now this should be clear. Cleared, presumably. Yes, okay. There we go, we can. Oh, hello, Lore. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, nope, and I'm stuck in the mask in here. Interesting, okay. Oh, oh hey! Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> hey. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Oh, yeah, we're definitely stuck in the mask for this entire... Well, we now are also stuck in the dream or in the nap. Right. That's right. I think that's you're totally right with that. Right. We are now caught in a part Cause, of this. Because that it, it's that thing, isn't it? He's talking about naps, but that's because that's like his programming as a daycare right. attendant. It's more about being stuck in in this like virtual space. Yeah. This alternate like mindset. Mm -hmm. So it, it, it's also interesting. We didn't get a chance to really talk about this last time. Yeah. But the idea that this was Vanny's mask. Yeah. And this was what she was seeing at the time. Yeah, which is, I guess, how she was able to get around the pizza plex so right? easily. Does it tell us? And I can't take it off. I keep being like, I want to take this off. I want to take this off, but I Have can't. Have a look, yeah. Yeah, you're stuck in this to look through. But the idea of like, okay, so this was Vanny was seeing the entire time. So was she corrupted the entire time? Like at this point, had she been like fully transformed? Was she being... Summon by because because you'll notice like I'm wearing the mask but I'm fine for now. Yeah. Eventually I will be taken over. I have no doubt. Well, and I guess that was the thing, wasn't it? Okay, we can take the mask off. Great. Yeah. Um, I was gonna say because in FNAF, v the whole thing with Vanessa was in FNAF VR. Yeah. She was like infected by glitch trap. Mm -hmm. And then she then went on to create the Vanny mask right. so that she could see these things, access these things. It's, it, so the Vanny mask itself was not a, I'm taking over you via this. Huh. So we had to kind of do that in order to... So he's now... Yeah. Okay, nope. So we had to do this to find the generator. I appreciate that someone has put the arrows there for us. <laughs> who was that voice? Right? Who was that voice? That was a much deeper yeah. Gregory voice. Okay, can I crawl through this little thing? This is a good place to hide some stuff. No. Is, is that a joke? That looks like it's a... Uh... I mean, it looks like it. It's not the same generator from the lot. No, it's, no, it's different. something else. Okay. Maybe? Unless, yes. unless we VR. It's like a custodial mm. cart, I think. Yeah. That makes sense. Interesting that it does change your perspective to try and get you to look at something. At that time, I don't know what it was, but yeah. it obviously just shifted our camera up. Right. Which is interesting. Hmm. Also, another thing that is... This, this section of the game, or like the, the daycare section originally, mm -hmm. was always tricky because yeah. there's so many different nooks and crannies that all look the same. Yeah. And so I was constantly like concerned that I was going to miss something. Hey. Yeah. So this are. is the, I, rem I reckon, remember this bit being locked yeah. behind the desk at the back. Hey, our son Flush. See what he's got. I used to have so much fun in the daycare. Used. <laughs> huh. Interesting. So is that, I wonder if that's, if someone's speaking to us through that. Because again, it's like, I used to, it's all first person. Is that Cass reminiscing, seeing the thing going, I used to have so much fun. Or is that someone else, like Gregory or, fun for fun. or Charlie exactly. or Elizabeth or something like that going? Right? Hmm, I don't know. Also, it's just an we've been talking about real collectible. I, oh, I guess they're not real. Because I was like, oh, uh, does the equipment count as real collectibles? No, but no, it equipment. doesn't. No, it's still that's equipment. Its it is a separate thing. Static doesn't work in the headset. 
mm. for some reason. But like here's static, and I'm looking at it, and it's nothing. It's like a wall. The wall. Oh, yeah. And it just disappears. And that's the same thing that we had when we first entered this area too, where mm. there's a big static screen, and it doesn't give you anything back. Very bizarre. Very suspicious detail. That is a drippy cloud. You are dripping all sorts of data, my cloud friend. Oh, hello. Oh, that is that something is. that may or may not need to be deactivated in order to unlock some ending that I don't know what's going to do. Love it. Love just the amount of light. We're just, we're, we're winging it. <laughs> Can I get in through here? I imagine there'll be another path in. There will be another path in. Fine. I'm sorry. You want me to do the easy way? The intended route? I'm sorry. Come on, Tom. I'm sorry, Matt. <laughs> I didn't make it. Uh, so, yeah, so there was a okay. glitch. Oh, here we here. go. Oh. oh, no, that's just for the camera thing. Okay, so I need... Oh, there he is. Ah. We need to the sun. There we go. Perfect. Oh, but we have to do it the other order again. Oh, yeah. So, this, so basically, this is just teaching us, like, hey... Spot the, it's basically a, a find the object challenge, mm. and you just got to do it in the order that it's presented. Yeah. I like that this is basically... There it is. Five and one. This is, I'm on surveillance duty. Yeah, that <laughs> game. observation duty. Obser uh, yeah, I'm on, uh, that's right, I'm, I'm like, that's not the name of it, I'm observation duty. Okay, well, that's, there we go. So that's how we're going to get to our robot friend. Thank you. Thank you. It, it, had a, it had a moment there. It had, it had to think about it. Okay, so now we're, now we're stuck in, in Dreamland. Right. Ooh. Ooh, hello, glitch man. Interesting. So that object just appeared and stopped you, which is, I wonder if that's going to end up being something later. Okay, we got, we got lore. Oops, Side of Moon aren't happy. <laughs> I've had a falling out. Got more screaming children. Whispers of, of the damned. As you do. Yeah, he's in that bit. He isn't over there. Can I get over to him? Hmm. Maybe over the top. Oh, oh, oh! I don't like you. I like that he's digital, but he can't get through the bars here. He's like, yeah. curses! These, these children's bars are too strong for Again, me! Again, it's that weird line of, like, digital and reality mixing. Right. And not being sure... How. Right. They mix, because it's like, he's digital, so he can just disappear at whim, but he can't get through the bars physically. Right. Weird. Like, oh man, you've beaten me. Yeah, <laughs> you've bested With me, your child. Basic security Play. measures. <laughs> so sorry, Moon. I'm not. <laughs> no, I feel bad for a guy. I'm like, he's like trying to find a place to just hang out, and we keep like... He keeps standing in the exact areas that we need him to stand in to shine our, our lights on him. And whose fault is that? <laughs> I'll go for the daycare attendant because we've now got to jam our wrench into the back of his head. <laughs> As you do. As you do. Oh, whoa! Hey, 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 did Oh, hey, he genie really, bunny. Yeah, he is really a genie bunny, hey, isn't he? Hey, genie bunny, <laughs> stay away. How about no, friend? <laughs> Get out of here, yo weirdo Robin Williams wannabe. <laughs> you will never replace him. How dare you stood where he stood. How dare you stand, <laughs> How dare where, you? He How dare you stand where he stood. <laughs> you can't do celebrity impressions like he can. Oh. Uh, uh, where are we at? Here? No. And I hate it. It feels like there's a sludgy sound when you put it on. Yeah, it's kind of like... Whoa, whoa. It's like a... Yeah. It's weird. It's, it's, it's very clothy or, or very heavy. Mm, yeah, no, I can see that. Like a cloak. Like a cloak being like wrapped around your body in some way. That's just one of That's the, the one That, that was the way we yeah. went through yeah, the security node. Any other AR objects around here? Wouldn't mind an AR object. I like me some collectibles. Oh, there's some Oh, hello. Crying children. Wonderful. No? Can I face through you? I cannot face through you. And you're blocking that. Okay, cool. Well, good times. Good times are had by all. <sighs> A daycare full of dead ends as usual. Right? It's so confusing. I mean, the benefit of this is that 
you you've not got the tippy tappy. Ninety nine. No, it's right. I was gonna say uh, going on because that was what. <laughs> no lights. It does say no lights. I don't, I don't believe you though. No, because that was what made it worse. Oh, him you, just were, you were getting like, lost. Oh yeah. And I, then going, he could just appear yeah. at any point around the corner. And particularly, the, the more generators you turned on, the more he started crawling like a spider, and that made it horrible. Right, so here he is. I guess we got a... Hey, bud. Oh, there it was. Ooh. I like that you can see his circuit board. That's fun. That is cool. Reboot. Let's scan the circuit board and upload it to the system. Because <laughs> that worked so well for us the right. first time. <laughs> Because now they're going to be one, so this is like... Eclipse. It is Eclipse. Warning, warning. Child in danger. Safety mode active. Little girl, you can't be in here. It's dangerous. I need to clean up before we can open in the morning. All oh, this place will be flooded with kids. Come back soon and have a fascinating day. Thanks, bud. I thought it was like what he's meant to be. Yeah, that's right. He's meant to be. Rather than split in two. Huh. That's so interesting. Right? That's so, so interesting. And, and this whole time, he was always Eclipse. Two halves of this mm. one whole. Yeah. Well, because I, I think it's in the next set of Fazbear of um, Tales books that are coming. There is the story of how he became who he is. Oh, is that true? I think so. I there like that every Faz book it seems like it teases a sun and moon story at yeah. some point. And like then... there, there's been talk about it about it's the fact that he was designed for like shows and so he would play both villain and hero, but yeah. then they reassigned to daycare but couldn't deactivate mm. because it's part of a whole. You can't deactivate this half, of, half him, of it, but they weren't. So I'd be interested to see if that plays into it at all because he was like the one animatronic we were just sat there going, don't know what to do with him. Right. He's just like, he's, we don't know if he's possessed. Like This actually gives him some kind of closure, I guess. But right. still doesn't answer a lot. No, not a whole lot, actually. <laughs> okay, so here we are. Can I open any of you up? No, but I know that there is... Okay, so there's, there's a, a rabbit bunny, face there. New bunny head. And yeah, what do we got? Hello. Huh. Oh, okay. It's gonna be like, wait a minute. It just, it just go out. I like that it's not him, it's the table next to him. Yep. Definitely not the super obvious AI No, robot. certainly not the evil robot animatronic thing, that's fine. That are like, phasing in and out of existence. No, no, no. no the no. table! <laughs> it's the table! Yeah, the security nodes thing, I'm like, how? <laughs> like, how much of this world is like, connected to the AI? Because it's all these inanimate objects. It's not like, electric systems, it's like, here's a can, oh. here's a table. Right. Which is funny, because they're, like, none of them are actually, like, permanent things in the space. Yeah, they're all being around. It's like, this around. pizza. Yeah. And they're like, oh, okay. So how does... So this pizza just has to remain here forever, I yeah, guess. Yeah, it's like... And, and it's a thing of, like, what counts as security node? Why is it security node? Who put that there? Who decided that this was the way to make this work? <laughs> Again, Fazbear Entertainment constantly... Confounding. <laughs> they make they make odd decisions, you know. Okay, there's definitely one that's back here. So that's that's the far one. It seems like. Oh, hello. Oh, oh! <gasps> oh no! Not this game again. Hi. No. Oh, putting on the mask means he ignores you. He doesn't see you. Right. That's, that's interesting. I become invisible to him. Interesting. That's really interesting, actually. That is. They can only... Ooh. Yeah, so you can hear... It. They were always very heavy. Yeah. You could feel the thumps. So interesting. Are they... I guess because you're them in the system. I was going to say... And so they it's... recognize you as one of their own. Well, it, or... it's either that or similar to, I mean, the earliest days, right, of the mm. franchise where it's like, hey, if you put on the animatronic mask... They don't recognize you. They're not going to recognize you. Hmm. This is glitchy back here. This is fascinating. Right? There's a lot of, there's a lot to, like, chew on when it comes to, what does all of this actually mean? Yeah. Fascinating. It's a lot of stuff to actually, like, process. 
Okay, we got the comedy mask. Comedy tomorrow, tragedy tonight. Laugh. Yeah. Great. <laughs> Laugh. Cry. Well, I'm, I'm balanced as all things should be, I suppose. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's see. Got a game here. Mini game time. Mini game! And this is where it's like, yeah, don't get killed by the thing that's running around trying to. Presumably not, right? Yeah. Yeah. Got him. Yeah. Hey, oh. Tacked for. Oh. Oh, that's a plushie just got dropped. Wait, let's see. Ah, there you go. Ah, you are a node. Someone's thumping his way toward me. You're in the mask. You're fine. You're safe and protected. Right, you would. Now you're not. <laughs> right? Doesn't seem like that's the case. I mean, there was. He, so he. Oh, the doors. He's a thumpy boy. He's a thumpy boy. <laughs> He's a thumpy boy. All right, so that was, what, animatronic node two, I guess? Yes. Oh, wait a minute. Here's a child that needs to be deactivated or something. Good night. <laughs> be quiet. I'm sick of your digital noise. I've got enough stuff to deal with right now. <laughs> right? I Come don't on. need to deal with you as well. Ain't got time for this. <laughs> okay, here's Thumpy Boy. Thumpy Boy. <gasps> Thump, yeah, there he is. Thumpy, hey, thumpy like boy. Thumper. <laughs> The rabbit from Bambi. <laughs> <laughs> it all connects. Oh. oh, that's so. Oh, that's so weird. Interesting. So he's just oh. patrolling. Back yeah, so he's just patrolling. So and when then, I when I've got it off. So he again, it's the mechanic of so it is, looking at him. So it is the red light, green light thing. Yeah, if you're looking at him, he can't move. Right, it's but red light, green light, away. but also. Hey, bud. We'd seen so many of them, I was wondering if they were going to activate. Right, I was wondering. Okay, so I'm safe regardless. So now he's just going to move, but so we're safe. There. there we go, deactivated. Oop. So that's all three nodes. And now you have to go so back he should to the rabbit he should be, Yeah, you've got to go back to the rabbit. Before I do, I just want to make sure that there's... No oh yeah, this was just all this stuff over here. Okay, so we should be good. So here, keep it in our sights. Is that no? Oh, no, that one was already under the table. Right, yeah, no, it, yeah, it's I think this is, it's off. only this. Oh, oh, no. Oh, hey. I thought he was suspect. Oh, oh boy. Okay, well, oh, hello. Because this is the challenge, right? Is we need to activate it in the mask anyway. Right. But obviously, if we have the mask on too long. Right. Buddy boy burn track appears. Oh. Okay, hey, hey everyone, hey everyone. We're just gonna, just gonna hop into this mini game real quick and try to solve this problem. Nice. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> that was a thanks. human way of saying that. <laughs> thanks, thanks, Cassie. Excuse me, what? <laughs> no. Camera system. Well, the door's shut, so I think we're safe. Right. They can't get through that. They can't get through it. I mean, genuinely, the mimic couldn't. Once it ripped the handle off, it, it thought is... it was wool. <laughs> that is interesting. No, you're totally right. Right? And again, that goes to one of the things that we didn't call out in the theory, but I think mm. that's a really good point. Like, the idea... So the reason why we think all the AI stuff and what led us down that conclusion is everything in the books has been the mimic, the mimic, the mimic. Yeah. And one of the things that they call out in the most recent book is the mimic does not know what a door is. Mm once the handle's removed. It knows a door is something with a handle that you open. But yeah. once the door knob is removed, suddenly it's like, what is this wall? I don't know how to deal with this. Which is interesting. Which is what these guys are doing. And there are so few doors with like doorknobs. Like, obviously you've got the little security doors, but like most of the big ones are those big shutters. Which right. therefore means you're like able to lock them out of areas without them going. Because they could prop. Let's be honest, in this franchise, they could probably just go. Yeah, lift, no, right. They would just be able to rip it open. Yeah, but no, totally. It, it's like a programming thing. Yeah. It's just like. It's funny because it's it's AI, but it's weirdly rudimentary. Yes. Because it doesn't. It, and this is where the difference of like AI versus language learning and all that come in. Because it's not thinking outside the box. Yep. It's just going. My program says this. This isn't that thing. Guess I'm moving it's on. Oh. Oh. Oh, because that was showing Fazbear. Freddy and friends. Oh. Freddy and friends on tour. But now we're seeing a security feed. There he is. That's oh, our yeah, boy. There, there he goes, running away. And I thought he said he hey. was under. She's wearing my mask. Mm, your mask? That's interesting. My mask. 
Like, but that, because that looks like footage from yeah. when Security Breach was happening. Yeah, Because right, he's that's supposed security. to be under Roxy Raceway right now. Yes, 100%. No, that's, that's like old archival footage or something. Mm -hmm. Okay, so there's our secret things that we gotta find. And we need it to be Sun, Moon, and and Bot. Security <laughs> Bot. Or like. A caution what, what, Bot? What, right, Caution Bot? Yeah, what are those guys They're, they're like um, the wet floor signs. Yeah, the wet, wet, wet floor it, bot. <laughs> wet floor. <laughs> Love that. Please make that a canon. Wet there. floor bot. Yeah, I forget what they're called. Like helper bots or something, right. I think is technically what they are. But. Okay, let's do this. Sun, moon. No. That's no. moon. So, okay. back to four. So oh. then it's three. Back, yeah, three, then one. Then. Or two, maybe. Yeah, two. There you go. Yeah, 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 I know, I know, I know. I know, I get it, I get you, I get you, I get you. I get Glitch Trump is you, here, I, I understand. I, I Trust me, I know, that was a long one, but we got through it, so there you go. <laughs> I get it, but also leave me- Oh! Oh my- oh, What why? the heck? Oh my gosh! What? I- Gotta be honest, wasn't expecting that. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's cool, though. That's really cool. Oh, that's nuts! What? That's epic. That's awesome. I love I that. I wonder if I was supposed to see him do that at some point. Yes. What are you doing, bud? Oh, 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 oh there oh, he hello. is. That's why. I'm not allowed to take off my mask right now. That's... Oh. But no, I can't. Yeah, well, it happened, I think, a couple uh, in the last episode we had that. Oh. oh, there he is, and he's still there. Don't go that way, though. Or just go through it without the mask on, I guess. I guess not. But, yeah, it does it a couple of times when you're in, like, a certain vicinity of him. Yeah. It's weird. Like, sometimes you can just do it straight away, and then other times it's like, no, you need to get out of his... Right. Not eye line, but... Oh, hey. And shut off some kids. <laughs> Sorry, bud. It's all for the law. Yeah. Sorry, I've, I'm, I'm a, I've got a, I've got a completionist goal that I gotta fulfill. I'm yeah. Sorry. This is when. This is gonna get me an ending, maybe. This is when we get to the end, and it's like you didn't get in because you're just I, a monster. Right, right. <laughs> All right. I'm waiting for him to turn on. This is the problem. Now that we know they get, they're know. activating, it's like when. Uh, no. Can I? Is there nothing behind? Me? I see a large circular tunnel behind you, sir. You deactivate that. Hmm. Feels like that should be the thing you're right. crawling through, Feels right? Feels like I should be able to crawl through this, yeah? Mm. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 Nope. Oh, nope, okay, well. Well, I like that, <laughs> sure. We're gonna say no. Giant robot attacking us through the screen. Legitimately awesome. It's an awesome visual. That's great. What does it say? Oh, that's graffiti. Jeremy. Uh, Jeremy! Uh, <laughs> don't you do It's pizza and Jeremy on the screen. Uh, of course it is. <laughs> of course it is. Because this franchise just loves Jeremy's. <laughs> It's just, it's just become like... It's, it's meaningless at this point. Yeah, well, that's, that's the thing. Like it's it like it's me memeing on itself right? at this point. Yeah, I, th I think at this point, any mention of Jeremy is like, okay, I'm just writing that off. Hey, you, uh -huh. seem, you seem like you might come active. You're weirdly placed in the middle of a room. <laughs> you're probably going to... Right, I feel like... We're going to walk past you. Hey guys. Because we're heading down, if we're in the daycare, we're heading down to, oh no. Yeah, we're heading down to that oh, area. Oh, uh, that was, so down would have been through those gates, I think. Oh down yeah, that's into down into where, the, the animatronic basement. Where the, the, all of the endos were. Right. Or one of the places all the endos were. Right. This is now heading up. This is heading up into uh, Sun and Moon's secret room? Uh, yeah, so to, so there. Oh yeah, Sun and Sun Moon's secret, secret room. room. There it is. So we're literally going in. Yeah, so. this was the secret room where they yeah. hit out and everyone was like, um, what does this mean? BB's Balloon World. BB's Balloon World is in here, yep. Come on. Ooh. Pile of trash. Actually, gold coins. Okay. Which again, goes back to this idea of, uh, you saw it in the books, you saw it with the sound illusion discs, like, oh, this thing that looks 
really mundane and stupid is actually a beautiful treasure or whatever, and it's all because of the sound illusion disc. This is when this room is unchanged. <laughs> oh. Are they showing you what it's supposed to be? Oh. So that we can actually get up onto there. Ooh. As well. Ooh. Ooh, hey. There's Eclipse. Who was there from the face, I would guess, then? We well, that's the also... End. That was from BB. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's the... Me, my, my fun, fun day. day. This guy, I remember him. He's still... This guy's still broken. Still, yeah, beaten up. Little Roxy. Roxy's having a little party. Roxy and Chica and Monty, everyone's... The Except gang's all Freddy. here. Freddy's not there. Yeah. This guy's still broken. In fact... He's not. Why? Yeah. Why him? And why? Like, clearly he's important enough that he's still broken in in VR, and yeah. he's shoved in a corner now for some reason. That's real weird. All right, let's get let's get our VR box, shall we? Yes. Yes. Here, anything else? So there's. No, gotta, uh, once we get this, I want to see if we can go. I, I imagine we're going to have to go through our secret tunnel. You would think the, that, right? Into the secret room that may. Have... Oh, okay. There's, there's. So it's like weird because it's like it feels timed, but it also feels like it's like. So it's timed in sense of like. The longer you have it, the more likely it is. But it's also there are certain moments where yeah, it's, key moments where it's just going to happen. Like you beat the puzzle, he's going to show up. Right. You beat, you collect the item, he's right. going to show up. But that being scripted, said, that's the one. Yeah, it's, it's event. scripted moments. Weird. It looks just like the other one. I AR see. Golden Moon. The AR Sun. Oh no, but that's a Golden Moon. Weird. It looks just like the other one. Oh, that's odd. There's AR golden plushies now. Yeah, interesting. Reboot the daycare attendant and access the theater. There is no dead end. Yes, because right now it looks like we're heading for a dead end, doesn't it, I suppose. Right. Huh. So there's our tunnel. Right? And I, and I feel a little bit conflicted about this, and I, I feel a little bit bad about this, too. It's because I'm wondering if I'm missing moments by taking off the mask too quickly. Because, mm. you know, like, when I hear the bum, and I'm, my impulse is just remove mask, mm. right? Because that so, means danger's nearby. But I'm wondering if that's making me miss moments of, like, oh, God, he's attacking me there, or, like, the giant robot. Like, I feel like maybe we could have seen the giant robot attack us maybe. if I hadn't immediately removed the mask. Yeah, hard to know whether it's, like, you pull out from the camera and he's just suddenly there. Or right. whether it is a... You watch that happen, but yeah, it's odd. Oh! Oh! Oh, hello, screaming child. Well, here, let's deactivate the screaming children first, because I, I want to attend to their needs. Yep. There you go. That, I just want to be thoughtful for them, considerate to their needs. So this is so this this is one of those rooms that was a real butter exotic butters. You gotta have exotic that butter butter butter, butter baby. <laughs> you butter believe it. That's all a human needs is ah. Uh, those are not there. No, this is all existing in VR. But this is stuff that we kind of saw. So they are about. They're like dotted around on the floor. But this VR is showing us the, the, order, of the order of the room. Or the room as it was supposed to be. Because right. it was the same in the other room. So those were all on the wall at some point. There's that mystery note again. Mystery novel. But that's a towel. Oh yeah, because it's, it's a box. So this is what... Should look like what Vanny wanted it to look like. Or whoever, yeah. Because because again, if you, imagine right, if this is, if if I'm wearing the mask and mm -hmm. it's giving me like the ideal version of this room, it, to me that says, oh, this is Van since Vanny's this is Vanny's room. mask, this yeah. is Vanny's room because this is how Vanny wanted. It. She was seeing the room this way. Yes, sure. That's what this seems to be telling me. Yeah, because you got a bed there. I know that having like Vanny be the one living up here, that's a very... It's weird because she has a room in right. Fazerblast as well. And there's then potentially yeah, she... down in the basement as well. Like she has a number... She just has all the rooms. Balloon Boy's Air Adventure, they're like, screw that game. <laughs> we're, we're getting rid of that, that guy. That, that ruined, ruined, that confused a lot of things. We're not gonna... Right, they're like, oh, here's our chance to like show it off again. Nah, never mind. Yeah, that's weird. It specifically said, like, a dead end is not a dead end. So clearly, this is not a dead end. And I mean, it does have a lot of, like, digital graphics coming off of it, which makes me suspicious. Hmm. That you could do something with this. 
But right, the, the lineup of this, what is this? Is this anything? It looks like a puzzle. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just, let's see. Yeah, just immediate just instinct is just taking right, off. Just yeah, take I get off. that. Anything on the floor? The floor is just clean, right? Yeah. That's a wooden floor. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okey -dokey. And I can't pick up. And again, like I'm like, oh, can I pick up these to arrange them in any sort of way? No, mm. not really. And there doesn't really look like there's anything new. No. In here either. Like I'm looking for oh, are there any new notes or any secret notes or things like that? But no, no, which is what I was saying is like this room is weirdly untouched. It yeah. probably is different. Like there, there will be different. Yeah, I'm sure. Sl but, but on the whole, it's as I rem it's ba it's basically how we remember it. Right. Um, which I guess makes sense if it's higher up in the building and there was earthquakes and stuff. I guess in the fire it would be the least destroyed. I guess. And it was a secret room as well. So. Right. Right. It's not going to have been touched by graffiti as or. Anyone trying to like recoup anything? This guy. Okay, so we did this. Hey, everyone. Is everyone active or no? Well, good. Well, feeling good. Feeling strong. Feeling good. <clears throat> so where are we going? Right, where are we going exactly at this moment? It was interesting that BB's air adventure was in the ceiling. You know that that the yeah. glitch eclipse and stuff was there. Mm. But it didn't seem well because like that be... was we followed the trail, right? And it felt it said night. It was like nighty night, wasn't it? At the end, it said like go to sleep or something like yeah. that. And that felt like the the purple glitches like we're seeing now. It feels like the yeah, um, we're... like that sense of like opening up the glitch or something like that. So the fact that that's now in the ceiling shows like a level of spread. Yep. Yeah. yeah at the end of really cool visual. Right. Watch, at, really, like... at the end of BB's air adventure, right? Yeah. Like, mm. It and the glitchy ending was like. Yeah, nighty night and everything was kind of like glitching out purple and stuff. And yeah, it feels like we're now in that world or we're yeah. experiencing that world in some way. Right, so get to the theater. Or in the theater now. Well, and this was the issue with Security Breach was the, the hints as to what the story is supposed to be or what right. the um, missions are supposed to be are vague. Yeah. And so you're like, like, so it's like, activate the daycare attendant. It's like, well, we've done that. So what's next? Reboot the daycare attendant and access the theater, which we did. We did both those things. Should we be growing through the screen at this point? Like, is this a... So he's here. Oh. Oh, into the... Oh! oh into his mouth. Stop! Help! It's all in your head. Take the mask off and take a look. Ah, uh, it's all in your head. Great, thanks. He's getting more corrupted. Yeah. You saw that there was more yeah, like sure. purple spread or, or blue spread on him. Mm. It's all in your head. Because that, again, as Matt's kind of said in Tiger Rock, that's a huge thing yeah. of he gets out of the VR and then he goes about his life and it turns out he's not out of the VR. Right. And it's only when he realizes he's still in VR that he can escape and force himself awake. Right. And and also then apparently then because unclear. he, yeah, even then it's unclear. Apparently it's only because he learned to lucid dream. Which is a whole thing. Right. <laughs> what is it? I love it. Every vent collapses. Ooh. Every single one. Every vent. Don't trust a vent in a video game. Ooh. Hey! Oh, this Woo! Is Monty's Gator Golf Ride! Gator Golf! Let's go! <laughs> Fun. We love ourselves some Gator Golf. <laughs> Hands up! Hands up if you're in the front row. It's a requirement. It is, absolutely. Let's go. Oh, you get to look around. I, I'll, I'll hold my hands up in solidarity. The Vanny Network is currently unavailable. Something seems to be jamming the signal. Mm hmm This is a regular. This is high, yeah. Cool. I love, like, teenage Monty there. Oh, yeah, yeah look, he's, he's looking up the to the band. Look, Glamrock yeah. Bonnie! Wow. We finally have a Glamrock Bonnie asset. <laughs> oh, and Glamrock Bonnie gives Ooh. him the guitar. This is the bass. That's that's lore right there. This is literally Monty's story. Oh look, they're it's, cutting his hair into his punk rock style. We are literally seeing Monty's lore. That's it is. This fun. is Monty's lore. That's fun. That's cool. Oh, on your right, I think. Yeah. I think so. can't put the mask. And then on. there he is. Yeah, you can't do the mask. Rock in the base. Nothing else going on behind us. Good for him. Go, right. 
<laughs> I like that. Live, like, live what's your... the mystery of Monty? What's his origin? It's uh, he, he yeah. just joined the band. Live your dreams. Uh, I love Bobby the idea. Gave it to him. I love the idea of yeah, teenage animatronics right. that grow up, <laughs> and grow up, and grow older. <laughs> Well then, you, let me have a. Then do I have a book for you? Oh, <laughs> it's, called, it's called the Fourth Closet. Oh, it talks all about. Okay. Wee! You could just jump there. Yeah, there you go. Awesome. That was fun. What a fun place this would be to yeah. to run around in. I do love it when it's like I got to get off this thing, and then he, they just do it. Yeah, <laughs> You're just like, like okay. No quick time event, no, no sense of actual no. impending doom. Just gotta get out, you know. Ooh. Oh, except if you do that. That is a sense of impending <laughs> doom. <laughs> what? What? I like that I've gotten two game overs. One was like kind of the scripted one of like, oh, he's gonna get you and this is the danger that happens. The second one was, I fell oh. off a slightly high platform. <laughs> I mean, and twisted my ankle. We, we we know that that safety precaution is not Fazbear's first priority. No, <laughs> certainly not. What you didn't know is there's just a pit of spikes underneath, uh -huh. and that is that is how that works. That's amazing. You know, old school Sonic rules of just. <laughs> Wait, so what did I? What did I, I fell? You oh, fell I fell off, off there into, there. into the abyss. Into the water. Okay, so good to know. So Cassie can't swim. Yeah. Robot. <laughs> He's a I robot. Need to get you said I could get to the raceway from here. Hold on. Schematics say there's a way to redirect the gondolas to the maintenance room. Deactivate the security node, then use the track controller. Gregory, you there? Of course not. So, security node and tracking controller. Whatever that is. Oh, hello. Hello thing that I'm gonna have to, like, shoot. Oh, oh, hello. Slippery. Oh, it's that lovely gunky stuff. Oh, it's trying to push me into it. Interesting. Mm. And I can't back this. We're gonna thing have to do platforming. Oh, what are we doing? This? What are you doing over there? What are you doing over there? You mysterious floating that You mysterious floating Monty head. Ooh. Everyone, every game's got to have ice physics. It does. <laughs> it is a legal requirement to have ice physics. Can I? Do I gotta get to you from over there, I guess. Ah. I guess. Huh. Interesting. And you are just leading me into slippery land. Is any object there or something I need to do? No, I... I doesn't really look it, like it, looks does it? like it would curve around, I guess, but... I don't look like it. But then you can't go anywhere from here, so... Yeah. Yeah, so it going. goes okay, through so we got. Alright, so we gotta find an alternate way, basically. This is just a trap. <laughs> the little squeaky sounds. <laughs> <laughs> it's dangerous and squeaky. Okay, here we go. I like that the gondolas themselves are AR. Yeah, and again, it, it, oh, it's confusing as to how this world operates. Oh, hello, slippery. Oh, hello, slippery floor. There's a camera. Cool. Mm. Not a whole lot going on. Yeah, I'm oh, not. Glitchy. I'm not is sure. And I can't. I can't. And again, like I keep expecting these cameras to give me the chance of like I can call use. An I can call an animatronic or distract him, but it it, it doesn't do it. Like it's not even an option. Mm. Yeah, yeah, the cameras have been a weird Ooh. system where it's like I'm not entirely sure what they're used for. Okay, there's there's my buddy down there. Mm. I gotta deactivate you, bud. Oh. Oh, hey. Is that it? I had you for a second. Yeah! Got him. Sorry, my man. Oh, God! Oh, yes. Great. <laughs> oh, that was fun. I think the thing is, you get loud and my, my I have, like, fight or flight responses freeze. Right. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> I don't know how to Please respond. <laughs> oh, we gotta do, oh no. Okay, so this is this is where it gets a little bit trickier now. This is called problem solving. Yeah! There we go. Nice. I'm proud of my abilities to do that. Good for me. Pat myself on the back, man. There you go. I, I will I will pat you Thank on the you. back because <laughs> you're you're otherwise Ooh. occupied. <laughs> okay, so we got our little guy. 
And he's got it. He's got it. Nope. <laughs> Certainly not. He's not even there. He wasn't there to begin with. Oh, but it's a secret around that side, maybe? Nope. Who do we activate? So we activated you, which in turn activated what? This is why I like Purple Land. Purple Land is bright. Re re and reveals everything, doesn't it? Right, Purple Land going. makes it very clear what I'm looking at. What are those, those monitors are just being weird. The monitors are being super suspicious. It's cool that you can use it while the mask is on. Yeah. That is helpful. Yeah, so looking through the camera, you can still see the stuff. The, cam like, the camera's picking up the <laughs> AR stuff. Right? It's like, oh, you must be clearly looking through me with uh, with the mask on. Like, so the AR is there. It's physical data that the camera is able to see. Read, <laughs> Read about. <gasps> can I just say, good for us to figure out that we had to climb into the animatronic's mouth. Mm -hmm. That was that was purely off of the environmental storytelling. That was of, a good moment. Of, hey... <laughs> This large thing is still hanging out here, and you know there are boxes that kind of lead in his general direction. Mm. Oh, do we need to use this can I, can and I? hit that? Well, in V, because in VR mode, there it yeah. is. Yeah, there it is. Gotta play some. Oh, here we go. Okay, there we go. Yeah, so I drop that, and then there'll be another one later. Okay, get out. I think. Get out. Go. Okay. What happens if I ran out of? Have to restart it then? I would guess. Right. Okay, here it is. There it is. That makes more sense to me now. That red cape. Uh, was it leading up to where that light is? Yeah, we got this guy. Squeaky. Yeah, the red. Uh, yeah. The red's going up there to. Ooh. Bloating. Bucket. bucket. That's uh, that's the, the bucket, bucket yeah, from yeah, yeah. previous. Okay. I was right, this feels like this is. Oh? Maybe. Oh no, it's like it's carrying over. Further. Right? Weird. Right? A lot. Oh, hello. Oh, you don't exist. Mm. That it does now. <laughs> Great. So be careful where you take off your mask, huh? Hmm. This is fun though. I'm enjoying puzzle the puzzle solving. Right? This is a big old big old maze. Okay. Okay, big old maze. Going Let's up see. here. On this way. I'm another camera system. I'm gonna go over to here, and then this should be safe, right? Like now, I'm, I'm now I'm really paranoid to take off my mask in a mm -hmm. place where it's like, surprise! That it doesn't actually exist in real life. What is this telling me? Am I gonna need this to like lure I, someone around I'm, at I'm, some point? I'm reckoning. Because when we had the mask on, it shows you where the um, yeah where the, the floaty things are that yeah. you're shooting, and my guess is that's what we're one of the things we're aiming for is to get all of those. But like, there's one there. So it's so if you turn to your left, there was a gun. Oh yeah. There. Oh good eye. Yep, there it is. A gun, weirdly hard to see in the VR compared right. to everything else. But now we've got three targets to go for. Okay. That looked safe. Totally I, fine. I, I, I would trust walking across that. This is totally fine and normal and completely good for everyone. There's our red cable friend down here. Right? Feels like to be. That's solid. Do we do we trust that glitchy little guy? I think we kind of have I to. Think right? we, I think I don't think we have much of a choice. Just <laughs> say down and up, one way and then the other. So let's do it. Yeah, with our. Uh, yeah, and then there's all. Stuff. Yeah, there it is. There's one. Where's that green box? I know there's an AR object around here somewhere. <laughs> that it's somewhere. that I'm like I'm like you're I'm I, I'm circling you this entire time. <laughs> nope. Hey, slippery. Good boy. Oh, okay, there we go. And we're back. And we're here. I love the fact that there are no real world objects. 
Just absolutely Every none. Everything is virtual. Everything is fake. I mean, welcome, welcome to the modern times. Yeah. That's it. It's all a commentary. <laughs> right? This whole thing. Yeah, it wasn't dream theory. It was just meta. It was <laughs> AR theory. <laughs> oh. He's got a double face? He's got a two-headed. Two-headed Monty, huh? Kinda, isn't it? Yeah. Weird. Got kind of joins. Monty and Monty's brother. <laughs> the less successful known. Monty and... Wanty. <laughs> I was gonna say, yeah, we'll go for War Mario Wario rules. <laughs> so close. Right, we're so close. So close and yet. Wait, so oh, close. wait a minute. Oh, wait, there's a. Wait, a real life object! An actual collectible map! You gotta, you gotta balance yourself. I am. Oh! Oh! oh. Are we collecting the endings from Security Breach as it's, comics? It seems like it. That's a clever way to make your. Slightly strange comic book endings <laughs> feel legit. That's great. That's so interesting. Weird. Okay. So we, we knocked we knocked down <clears throat> we knocked down those those targets and they opened up this. <clears throat> right? They opened this up, didn't they? Yes. So how do we get across exactly? So go back round and down, I think. So you get across this bit where there's a double Monty face. Okay. And then I think you just turn left. Okay. No, because no, this is no, black. So that's so, so that turns it. So do you have to go, go all the way back round and then? Maybe that's what it is. Let's, let's try that. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. Because then this is. I ended up not going this way before. Yes. There's the AR object around here. There it is. There's another one over there in the distance. Saw that. AR sun pinata! Filled with sun drop candy. Fantastic. How, how does AR candy work? If it's an AR pinata, is the candy also AR? <laughs> ooh. Oh, that's just Monty's face. For a second there, I'm like, ooh, is that like a... FNAF 4 animatronic, but nah, no. it's just Monty. Just Monty. Just a typical Monty. And that is what drove him to destroy Bonnie in the first place, was that attitude. Right. <laughs> just Monty. Oh man, just Monty. Is this like a trap so we can't get back? That's it? That's the one way to get? Can't be shortly, because there was a thing over that way. No. There we go. Yeah, I just jumped over it. <clears throat> okay, so we blew this one. We gotta figure out how to get to the other side. So... so. Following this cable this way, I guess. Right? All right, let's see where we're at. Okay, so there's another set of targets over there. Yep. So we need to find another gun. I was gonna say this was big, but Monty's, like, the crosswalks were always quite large for Monty. Right, no, It always right. felt big. It's just, I guess, you don't take it in because you're running around trying you're, to fire cannonballs. Right, exactly. Yeah, you're, you're trying to juggle so much during that boss battle. Mm. A really tricky one, particularly if you... It's even trickier if you do it post-game. The boss battle? But because there's, like, no safe... Or they, they ended up having a safe point. That's but, like, right, eventually. Like, doing that is, is tough. All right, we figured it out, which was literally make a different turn. <laughs> we just missed the turn. Nailed it. Crucial. Whatever that is, I don't like it. I don't know what that was. It sounded like someone was mad at me. Oh, hello. Oh, this will be, because there's a Another platform, bridge. I guess. Oh, that is, um... What is that? Land? What is that? Ears? Oh, oh where? Ugh, I get a puke. How did I get over here? The security system won't you are on two feet, silly. If you're tired, why don't you take a break? I guess we go through that one, oh, then. Bud. They're messing with my brain. Toggle oh. mask. Bye. Bye, bunny. Bye, bye. As long as I don't move into your body, I seem like I'm okay. Yeah, it feels like a weird system. It's like walk into him, you'll probably die. If you leave him up long enough, he'll summon someone else. Right. Because I think that's what happened the first time we were so right. busy looking at him. Monty showed up. Right. Like, should I be phasing it? Like, it, it feels like they want me to like walk into him. Like, in that moment, it felt like 
I feel like death, is script, death, I feel like death would happen. You think that was a death moment? I, I think it all would be it. Like, because the scripted moments, some of the scripted moments, he's like appearing and disappearing, like in the um, daycare where he was like appearing on the other side of me. Right. Ah, yes, this random fallen over plush. I'm glad that they uh, their security systems are so high. It, it, it's pretty elaborate here at the old pizza plex. The AI systems here are, are pretty next gen. I mean, it would be pretty hard to figure out. It's a valid it would, point. It would be very hard to figure out. It is hard for me to figure out when I have all that information available to me. So. Exactly. Hackers beware. <laughs> Good luck, guys. Weird. That was just a long way back? Yes. Why would you give me this long way back? That's suspicious. That's reading as suspicious to me. I'm just calling it. Hmm? Now I was gonna be like, can I drop down? Mm. Or is there something in the bucket? Like, why would you offer me that option? No. It makes me curious. Oh, we've got one. Oh, what? Here. Mm. Let's check out the real collectible. I, mean, I am curious about yeah. this real collectible here. It's one of Gregory's comics. Oh, no. Page two. Which is interesting, because that's normally the main ending. So, unless... Oh, no. Is this going to be, like, the whole of Security Breach was... <laughs> Again, I keep, what, like, fearing Dream Theory 2.0. <laughs> that's a Greg... If Gregory's comic, so he drew that. It's not Dream Theory. It's AR Theory. Oh, it's yes. completely different. I mean, things. I mean, to be fair, it was the thing of, like, you know, GGY. Mm -hmm. He is not a good guy in that game. No. Or in that book. And so it's then making you go, well, where, how does that fit in with this? Oh, shit, there we go. Oh, fuck. Nice. Nice. No. There you go. There we go, pop out of that. Nice shot. Thanks, <laughs> bud. That's why I'm a pro gamer. Me and my max gaming skills. No la no, no bridge there. Nope, certainly not. That is why people tune into GT Not Live for my excellent solving of lore and my pro tier stats. Gamer strats. <laughs> stats and strats, that, that's my name. That's accurate. Yeah, I, I hear you, Gregs. Yeah, I'm, what do you think I'm doing? I think I'm taking a relaxing vacation over here, Gregster? Mm. Greggy Weggy. Spoiler alert, I'm working. I'm hard at work over here, okay? That's gonna be definitely a node. That's the node. That, that suspicious chair, brightly colored chair off in the distance, yeah. Definitely a node. Got him. Alright. Okie dokie. There's a lot of these things. And I just. For them know. being. Purposeless. Yeah, being <laughs> like, entire. Like, like, what am I supposed to be doing? With I these? guess it's they're trying to show you where you should be going. Next, I, I guess. I guess. Like, so that's cool. so you look at that with VR now. You can see, oh, there's like a VR tube that you can get through. But it is weird, right? Right. Like, again, like the map systems in this game have never been. <laughs> never been their strongest suit. No, it's never been the easiest thing to follow. Yeah. So it's like, great, I can see this on a camera. I've got no semblance of where that is. Right. Wait, that's not really helping me out a whole lot. And it's also not giving me a whole lot of new information. Okay, so here's ah. the tube. This is where we're going. Right. But like, I would have found this anyway, right? Like, yeah. outside of, oh, we're gonna guide you kind of in the direction that you're supposed to head. Like, I would have found uh, this. Oh, no. Oh. No. Is this the walkway above? Vanny. Yeah, this is to like well, Vanny's area. That's what it reminds me. Yeah. Oh. 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 Move. Oh. 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 What, what happened to it? Entity. I took care of it. The area is safe now. Huh. So. No? What? Really? What? Really, Dr. Rabbit? <laughs> no, I don't believe you. That is weird. There's no world where that's true. There's a, a very small parkour jump. Right. 
Should I do this first or do this first? Let's do the parkour jump first. Parkour! Yeah, that is like the heaviest jump in the world. It is a very heavy jump. <laughs> like, ooh! The, uh, it doesn't look real. Doesn't, doesn't quite look me. real. I mean... I mean, you're not wrong. That's that the po point of AR. Okay, let's do this node. That was interesting. Because huh. it, like, it tried to get us and then couldn't. And then couldn't, and Greg's like, hey... I updated him. I update. I updated him, and help. He's like, I took care of it. Right. So we've got conflicting narratives there. Unless Helpy and Gregory. Are unless Helpy and so. Gregory are one. Greg, what are you waiting for, dude? Like, there, I've, there's a lot I've got to take in right now. I thought I was just coming to help a friend. Now I'm in an AR pizzaplex, and things are real and not real. And I can teleport, like. You gotta give me a break, man. Oh, hey, here we go. Oh, no, so this is how you're meant to get to him. But we, we cheesed it. <laughs> you may have cheesed it just slightly. That's fine. That's fine. You know what? I'm allowed I'm allowed some cheese every once in a while. I feel, I feel like I've earned my cheese. Absolutely. King of the cheese. Okay, so just get like back to the gondola. Just like a rat gondolas. in a maze. <laughs> is this the gondola that you wanted me to get to this whole time? That's the one that it, we, we, we wanted to get I on. Really, I really time. want to get on this gondola. I'm just saying. <laughs> This gondola is very attractive to me. I know I got to go to the, the bunny rabbit mission. Yep. So he's not going to bother me anymore? I bet he will. I have like, a, Spoiler alert, the bunny will continue to bother me. Yeah, it, it's more just uh, you might not have to worry about him for a single amount of time. Right, but. I feel like that's it. Okay. Oh, we got three now. Oh, no. Yes, that has to go back around the outside. Okay. Nice. Yeah, I love mental puzzles. <laughs> Go figure. Ooh, hello! Oh, yeah, look, again, that train of stuff all, we're opening stuff up and it's all heading somewhere. Right. It's leading us there. Okay, so now that we've done this, and again, you have to wear the mask, you have to wear the mask, you have to wear the mask. It is. the At the end of the day, it's all those security bots, the helper bots. Mm. That's what is going to de determine the ending here. Yeah, because you can only get to like, those in. Yeah, because no matter what, I, I can't imagine a version of this game where you are not wearing the mask anymore. Like at a certain point at the beginning, I was like, oh, it's the mask, it's the mask. Mm. You have to use the mask. Now it's about, are you deactivating all these helper bots along the mm -hmm. way? Hopefully I've been doing a thorough enough job. I feel like I have. Yeah. Like, but there's a lot of nooks it, and crannies in this and game. And it's interesting because it, you do get the audio cues. Mm -hmm. Like when you put on the mask, you hear the crying. Where is this? Right, where is this? I mean, presumably we actually, we may not have come here. Because this true. is like behind the scenes where the gondolas are loaded up. Right? Redirect the gondola, where are you? Now, look, the missions of the game are asking the exact same things we are. You're getting closer. How do you know? Yeah. How are you doing any of this? I'll explain it all when you get here. That thing is here again. I gotta hide. Save me, Cassie, please. Mm. That thing is here again. Is it now? Yeah, interesting to know whether that thing is the same digital thing and it's just, or it's like, again, well, I was going to say, it's faking it in a sense. Or but, it could be the blob. Or it could be the blob. I mean, there's a lot of options that yeah. it could be. Yeah, that thing. That's the thing. It's like fake enough. Right. At this point, at least. Yeah. Well, particularly because the blob is a house you describe him. Right. Oh, the blob. The Freddy Spaghetti is here. Freddy Spaghetti is the here. The mass of wire. Oh, hello. Yeah, I'm glad I jumped, double checked. AR Foxy plush. Hey, Foxy's in the game! Right? Yay. We love ourselves a Foxy. He exists. You say. That log ride was so much fun. Sure, buddy. Your thing. What? <laughs> what? What? What happened? What log ride? Yeah, that was. Oh. Loading. That's a, that was a loading screen. Okay, <laughs> okay, straight. Putting pizza on a conveyor belt. That's how you do that. That was so much fun. What log ride? There's never been a log ride, right? No. The only thing I can think of is in FNAF VR, there was the foxy, like, rail shooter, but that wasn't yeah, a log ride. Yeah, like, the only thing I can think of in this, in Security Breach specifically, is because he's he's Pirate Foxy around the place. He does so. Pirate Foxy. Yeah, he is Pirate Foxy. I don't remember there being one of the books. Because there's no. a lot of weird rides and extra attractions in the books. There's also a lot of weird foxies. Yeah. Sulfuric acid. High quality they're, product. They're very specific about that. 
Make note of that one. Why would they need sulfuric acid? Mm-hmm. A lot of it. To melt the bodies. Melt the bodies and pull a breaking bad. Oh, we're in Chica's, uh... Chica's Bakery? Yeah, back in... Yeah, this is this might be Chica's Bakery, which we've not done before. Which, yeah, which, even in the main game, like, you didn't need to do anything. Like, you could check it out, and it was vaguely interesting. Yeah. But there was nothing required to do there. I'm trying to get it. We're desperate to get into the middle to find that. Yeah. That bot. Yep. That's that's what I care about at this point, are my little, my little bots. There he is. Yeah, these are the guys I care about now. Deactivate you! <laughs> I'm sorry! I don't know what I did wrong! <laughs> I know that there's a... Okay, so there's, there's a ladder uh, out. And there, yeah, it was the Among Us game on the wall. Right. <laughs> How dare you! Do you think Do you think they were working on this and then Among Us became a thing? Well, no, I guess it, no, it, it came out been. afterward. But I was going to say, at one point, they had it be like an actual wire match game, and then all of a sudden they're like, oh, Among Us did it! Yeah, we need to like, come up yeah, with a new mechanic. Guys, guys, have you not heard of this? Like, <laughs> AR Glamrock. I'm not funny. I know, that oh, was no, the other one. Oh, it, was, here it, it was the plushie. Dad wouldn't tell me why they replaced Bonnie. I didn't think anyone knew other than... Oh, that, again, so well, no, but, this no, is Cassie's perspective. This is Cassie's perspective, and Cassie has the wrench, and her, or her dad has a wrench. So her dad worked so, for Fazbear. Her dad is clearly <laughs> William Afton. There you go. Her dad is Edwin from the books, who is clearly <laughs> canonical. It has to be. Absolutely. All right, here, we're going to fire this up, and I think we're at a good break. This yeah. feels like beating Gator Golf felt like a big thing. Yeah. This one's going to be tricky. Yeah. They're all the same. Oh, oh so right, close. Okay. Oh. oh, no. No! Yeah! yeah I just got okay. Him. Nice. Okay, so what is this activating here for me? Is it that door? The trash compactor? Or is that something else? Is that... The cupcake delivery service? It's activated or something. the cupcakes? What have we activated here? I don't know. Ooh. That is act whatever that is. Is, this. That, is that the trash compactor? No. It's, no. Uh, maybe. Else. Maybe it looks like we're gonna have to climb this ladder to find out. Mm-hmm. Okay, well let's check it out over here. Hello everybody. Okay. Well. Well, what did we just activate? You don't know. Well, you actually probably do know, because at this point you probably watched the entire upload of ever. Like <laughs> Dorko's got part 10 out already. <laughs> uh, yeah, like you, you, I think you made a joke about it last time where it's like uh, Fusion is like, what happens when you glitch outside the bound? We're already there. <laughs> Everyone's like, that was a week ago, man. Like, come on. It's only day two. The game's only been out for less than 48 hours. Give me time. <laughs> But uh, no, I, at this point, I expect all the endings have been ripped to shreds. All the secrets have been unveiled, and so this whole time, and we're like, derp, 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 let's act, let's deactivate the yellow things. What are their names again? Oh yeah, that's a thing. <laughs> womp, womp. You're all like, they're such idiots. It's not going to leave. Well, obviously, anything. you've missed five already. I know, right? <laughs> don't think I don't know. I'm sure. I'm sure I've missed one or two. Hmm? Maybe. Maybe. I feel like we've done a good job. I, I have faith in us. We've done. We, we, yeah, we've I done well. So anyway, uh, what it, what remains up the ladder? What did we just activate? What is the true ending of this game? How many endings are there? I don't know. We'll, we'll find out. But uh, how long is this? I, I don't know how long I actually don't is. know how long I, this I should, is. I should, I should at least probably check out one of the other guys. Yeah, the problem is, see, like, is it's, it's all depending on their uploads, basically, at this point. <laughs> I don't know. They've, they've probably beaten it at this point. Maybe we'll have like a neutral third party look ahead and be like, hey, how close to the end are we? Because it feels oh, like this to me, and again, this is, this is naive Matt Pat mm. saying it, I feel like we're at the halfway point. I, I, I hope you're right. <laughs> really? I'm, I actually, I hope I'm wrong because I'm enjoying this, but uh, It's also... more, more from the amount of time this is going to take more than so than... So anyway, you guys know, so the dramatic irony of this moment, appreciate it all you want. So anyway, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. We'll be back in the next upload. Uh, I'm excited to find out what it is. Leave your theories down in the comments below, provided you don't know how this whole thing is going to end. So I'm curious to read your thoughts. 
Uh, so, in the meantime, remember, that wasn't a live stream, but it was a video. A video for you. See ya!